Okay, hello everybody. Hey, my name is Sinkar and welcome back to another episode of Outer Wilds. <gasps> what today's plan is, and their plan is to head straight to Dark Bramble. How do I find what I'm looking for? And that, I cannot tell you, I have no idea. Easy does it, easy does it. Can't help but notice that my screen isn't on, but I suppose it doesn't need to be. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Stop moving ship, come on! So I'm going to attempt to go for that direction. Oh, there's the other one. I'm gonna head towards there, that direction. Oh right, that thing's there. Right, that's covering him up, okay. Um, I don't know if that's gonna be a fish or what, but I'm guessing it's probably a fish. <laughs> Shut up. Very curious as to what would happen if I hit one of the fish. I'm curious, but not insane. I'm not gonna try it, but you never know. Oh! 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 Yeah, that's about what I thought. Fair enough. Alright, that's cool. Those are lights, correct? It's not just a... <gasps> Ooh, hello! Hello, come to Papa! What have we got? I have no idea, but I'm going to have to get out and look at it, I think. Land, please. Land better. Unbuckle. Lovely stuff. Alright, got no fishy on the horizon, yeah? That would suck. If I could just walk, that'd be cool. Oh, we got music going on. Okay, what have we got here? What the hell am I looking at? Exactly. Oh my god! Oh my! Holy shit! These are... Bruh. No way. These are actual no my oh my oh they're hugging. All right, teach me. Whew, Seka. Who's Seka? To any who come here searching for us, we followed one of the two beacons from the vessel to this place, but now can go no further. It's almost too faint to hear now, but the vessel's beacon is still faintly emitting from within the thorny seed. Yet the opening is too small for even a single no my to fit through it. So our escape pod couldn't have flown from, couldn't have flown through here. Interesting. I don't understand how this could be possible, but this gruesome place seems to be able to ma manipulate space itself. Maybe this was our undoing. To be so close to the location of the vessel and still so far is difficult. Worse, the ve the vessel's beacon is dying soon. We will be unable to hear it. There is nothing we can do now but try to perhaps find a way inside, or at least attempt to comprehend why this happened. My dearest hope is that the other escape pods were able to reach relative safety. So these guys came from that missing escape pod. Escape pod... I don't know, but they came from the missing escape pod, right? So maybe these lights actually lead back to the escape pod. That's exciting. Um, but what interests me the most is the hugging people. Now, why do the hugging nomai interest me? Well, I'll tell you. Were they hugging nomai or was I insane? So what that tells me, what that's, what's interesting about that is that it to me shows um, that that the the nomai. At least these ones knew that they were about to die, and it seems very sudden. The fact that they're hugging like that makes it seem like something just hit, such as the sun exploding. So we'll go follow that, but first I would like to follow these little lights. Interesting that I can uh, actually track them. There's quite a few. There's no fish this way, so I think we should be fine. No nearby fishies. Cool, cool, cool. Which should be the case considering the Nomai. Well, I was gonna say we're fine, but I suppose they weren't in the end. But they made it all the way over there, so should be fine. 
Now that's proper flight. That's bacon. Oh, look at that. You are making noise. Great. That would have been really helpful earlier. Uh, but okay, you do you, I guess. Well, now I've got it logged. Okay, what are you? Our escape pod crashed as we tried to flee this place, destroying our movement and communication capabilities in the process. We've held out as long as we could there, but this pod's supply of breathable air is nearly depleted and the anglerfish attack more and more frequently. Our best chance at survival is to return to the vessel to either repair the damage or, more probably, await rescue. Seca is... Seca, is the message finished? The vessel's beacon is already growing fainter. It will be gone in a matter of hours. We need to leave here quickly. Right. Interesting that they... Were they just following a sound or was there an actual, like, beacon? Because if there was, then they should have been able to follow the duplicate signal. They should have had a duplicate signal. What the hell is this? I don't know, but it's freaky. I vibe, I vibe. Alright. Begin flight log. Escape pod 3. Vessel has been... Oi. Vessel has been mortally injured. Emergency sequence activated. Awaiting departure from vessel. Now launching escape pod 3. Multiple collisions have altered pod's trajectory. Significant damage to pod detected. Ripper runes. Ripper runes. So much for an escape pod, am I right? Woohoo! Oh, that's insensitive. And get in there. Yes, it does appear to be in the red seed, so we'll just gently drift my way over there. I want to be very, very gentle. Unbuckle. Don't eat me, I'm not a thing! Ah! We've met, we're here, we're here, this is where the vessel's at, oh my gosh. There it is. Oh, ge oh geez, there it is, okay, okay, why were we looking for the vessel again? I have no idea, I do not remember at all. This is just where the Nomai crashed originally when they came to this galaxy, I think. It's the original site. Uh, it's very exciting, there's an escape pod there, so I'll check that out first, but... Woo, mama! Oh boy! There it is, lads. That's the vessel. The vessel, the one we've been looking for. Well, land us right over here. Is that... Oh, oh, the escape pod's actually attached. Okay. So, is there a landing spot for my ship here? Doesn't look like it. TVH, but this also looks like a safe place to land. Hopefully there's some trees inside. Oh, cool! Dead kids! That's a lot of dead people. Okay, they're not babies. I thought they were babies. They look like babies. Dead babies would be much more exciting. Oh, I'm having the same problem being, you know, on the wrong angle. Uh, it's a struggle. It's a struggle. But it's what we do. I wish there was gravity here. Oh, why is there no gravity? Surely they have artificial gravity on here. Just out of power or something? It's pretty messed up, so fair, but... They do have trees, though. That's a plus. Okay, now if I could just rotate. There we go. Standing upright is important for me, okay? I just... Makes it easy to move around. How did you guys all die, though? Pick up... I'm sorry, what? Okay. I stuck a warp core in here. Oh! Puzzle? One that I'm too dumb to figure out? Ah, JK, I ain't dumb at all. Get wrecked, nerd. 
absolute nerd. Nailed it. Pushing! Okay, that didn't work. No! No, sun, now is not the time! Oh, are you kidding me? I hate the sun! The sun is so annoying! Ah! Ah! Alright, I wanna I wanna real quick explore everything else here. Have a quick nosy. See if there's anything else to look at. There is not. It is solely that one room. Which is cool. Oh, piss off with your fuel levels and your criticals. If there was gravity here, it'd be fine. Oh, those must be like escape pod rooms. Okay. Oh, hello. Oh, there's all sorts of stuff here. Alright, quick translate. This is Eskel's vessel. Something went badly wrong during our warp core. Time has not stopped. During our warp and our vessel is mortally wounded. We need help as quickly as possible. Um, our vessel appears to have... Has... Has it fueled with... Has it fused with the local environment somehow? There are vines that are now a part of the vessel. It's been torn apart from the inside itself. We we are abandoning our vessel. Any know my clans or spacefly capable species receiving this message, I implore you, we need your help. Um, is this broken? Can you hear me? Our vessel is dying. We need immediate assistance. No one heard you, buddy. Sorry. What is the glooming galaxy? I don't know, but holy shit was that interesting. Very interesting. Very unnerving that it took me that long to get there. It's clear the universe is dying. There are fewer and fewer resources and safe places within space now, so my clan and I believe the best option is for all clans to stay together. Makes sense to me. If you can reach the gloaming galaxy, we've found that Black Rock's suns are fairly stable and life in the star system is comparatively thriving. We live in relative safely, safety. Black rock? What's black rock? We don't know that, do we? No, that's that's not one of our places. And they call our places by the same name, so that doesn't make sense. If you prefer to continue exploring alone, know you will be on your own. Um, Kana, we're making our way to you. So the death of the sun was not their fault. The whole universe is dying, so that's great. That's a good point, actually. It's good to hear from you, Bromi. We'll watch for your vessel. Has anyone heard from Neem? His clan was on its way to our vessel, but they never arrived, and he hasn't sent any messages. I'm beginning to worry. Me too. That is unsettling. It reminds me of that old myth my grandfather used to tell about the disappearance of Eskal. Ah uh, yes, the disappearance of Eskel. I know that. I remember hearing that story as a child. One day Eskel's vessel simply stopped responding. The other clans searched and searched but found no trace. It was as if their missing friends had warped out of this, uh, out of existence. Jeez. Okay, don't want that. Um, that's no myth, friends. Eskel's clan existed and their story was real. It was. What a curious event to have passed into myth. Our ancestors ancestors were told that story when they were young. Are you sure it's true, he sobbed? It was a very long time ago, but yes, my clan's ancestors searched for Eskel's clan um, for a long time, but in the end, none of them were ever seen again. It's the only time in our history a vessel has ever disappeared this way. I hope you aren't comparing Eskel's story to this clan's, to my clan's vessel. <laughs> Neem, my friend, we feared you were gone. Not yet, we aren't. Not yet, we aren't, but nearly. We found a trouble during our walk. The triple suns of the Bright Spark star system exploded, and it was only a lucky coincidence we weren't caught in the blast. We'll meet you soon, Kana. I'm relieved your clan is safe, Neem. It's good to hear your words. Any vessels nearby, remember to be extremely cautious of potentially unstable stars, which is most of them now. Huh. Well, ain't that a bag of beans? That ain't a bag of beans. Those are bad beans. That's some warm beans right there. 
Now, if I could rotate and face the correct direction. That. Nailing it, nailing it, nailing it. That will do, donkey. That will do. Okay, this is this was vessel. Something went badly wrong during our warp. Our vessel is mortally wounded. We need help as quickly as possible. I'm just wondering if there was more to this that I missed. Um, our vessel appears to have has 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 it fused with the local environment somehow. Um, there are vines that are now part of the vessel. It's been torn apart from the inside itself. We are abandoning our vessel. Any Nomai clans or spaceflight capable species receiving this message, I implore you, we need help. Um, is this broken? Can anyone hear me? Our vessel is dying. We need immediate assistance. Cool. Okay. Now what? <laughs> now what? I'm... Hmm. Oh my gosh, that's the eye of the universe. That is the eye thingy. That is their symbol for the eye. Okay, okay. We got something going on here, buddies. We got something going on. Alright, let's read this. I'm recording now. I've never encountered anything like this. The signal the vessel is receiving appears to be older than the universe itself. That's why we were looking for this. Right. This is our first contact with anything of this nature. Everyone, prepare to warp immediately. Eskel, wait. I need more time to send an outgoing message. Shouldn't we tell another clan where we're going? We can send the message upon our arrival. This extraordinary signal appeared suddenly. It may disappear just as quickly, and we can't lose a discovery this incredible. Focus on preparing for the warp instead. I understand. Anona, the vessel... Uh, is the vessel ready to warp to the signal's approximate coordinates? The warp core is powered, but this will be a significant jump. Af afterwards, we'll need time to recharge the core. That would create a problem, provided we arrive at or near the signal source. Oh, that shouldn't create a problem. Everyone, we're ready to warp. Very, very interesting. Ship log updated. Whee! Ah, scrolly scroll. Found a recording. Yeah, 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 yada, 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 whatever. Um, where do I want to go? So, over here. Ah, this thing. So you see, you see this. This. I have an idea. I'm gonna take a photo of that. Like that, yes. Gently pop it out. Easy. Can't actually turn that off. Okay, next one is... Quite simple, like this. Seems to be like it matches, right? It matches. And then, lastly, Yuri, put the picture up on screen while I'm doing this, by the way. Uh, this one's, yeah, I mean, this one's straight up hexagon shaped. Like, it hits all of them. Okay, so, you know, naturally the other problem is the fact that the warp core is busted. So, you know, I'm not actually sure that we can do anything about that, but... I don't know, I, I feel like that was it, right? Like, that was the thing that we were to do. I'll work that out. But anyway, while I do that, let me wrap this episode up. So thank you all very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed today's episode of Outer Wilds. I for sure certainly did. Yeah, I just just taking things off and learning new things and you know working things out as we go but I think the only thing left to do there's the Quantum Moon and the Ash Twin Project so I think I think we'll go to the Quantum Moon next. Yeah, I hope to see you all in the next episode. Thank you all so very much for watching. Here comes the sun. My name has been Sinkara. And, well, you know, till next time, satisfy me as well by hitting that subscribe button, join the Discord server, link the bottom description, it's a great time. And until next time, see ya.